This exercise is press ups with rotation. Um, let me just quickly show it to you, and then uh, and then we'll talk about the coaching points. So it's a press up with a turn in it. Press up and a turn, basically. Yeah, simple as that. Um, let's go through the coaching points. So coaching points for the press up are we want to try to take it away from being shoulders and get it really mid chest. Um, things we're going to do for that is we're going to really tune into the heel of the palm on the floor and the back of the arms as a driver. Um, we're also going to feel the chest muscles expand when we go down and then squeeze us back up. So here we are, heel and palm down, squeeze back up. So chest expands around the rib cage and then back up. Feel those muscles get longer and then stretch and then squeeze back through that elastic stretch and squeeze back. Lots of heel of palm, back of the arm. That will really help us keep it on the midline, basically, and prevent shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Um, so for the turn, the most important thing we're gonna learn about is to keep the shoulder kind of just relaxed enough so that you don't kind of obstruct that opening movement, okay? Um, your bicep uh, runs you know, all the way from sort of down here, almost at the thumb in a way, where all this radial stuff ends. Um, and goes all the way up here to the shoulder. So it's going to be reasonably sort of stretched out during this movement. Um, and so we just want to keep it relaxed. You don't want to kind of grip it down. Don't get too tense along here. Don't press the floor too hard with the sort of thumb tension. Um, now you're going to look for a solid position, but that's really because you've got just a kind of vertical support really. You don't want tension, just relax into that vertical support. Keep your abs on, back down, same again. And then just don't get too tight on that shoulder when you turn around. Yeah, and that's pretty much press ups with rotation in its basic form. Um, we can advance it a little bit. So, if you've seen our explosive uh, press ups or plyometrics press ups video, then, and in fact, in a way, a lot of our plyometrics videos, we would have looked at that kind of uh, deceleration, acceleration movement, that kind of smooth change of direction, so that you don't kind of hit the ground hard. And jolt shoulders and things like that. Now in the ply in this press up with rotation, we can take it up a level by kind of almost dropping in for a deceleration and then just kind of dropping in. Yeah, and dropping in because the body weight comes down quick and then you have to really decelerate the body. Um, what you want to do in that case is all this mid chest thing is really important so you're not up in shoulders. We kind of talked about that in a steady push up position and then you're just looking for a deceleration that dials up rather than a hard landing that jol jolts through neck and shoulders um, so when you come back down through the press up what you don't want to do is bang hard you just want to kind of come through and just decelerate through gradual deceleration yeah and it actually is quite a bit more intense as you let the body weight fall in and catch it so there we are press up to rotation uh, let's have a look at the regressed version the simple version one last time just to press and turn over. Remember the number one thing is just listen to that shoulder. Don't let it get tight. Yeah. You've got nice abdominal action holding that straight line, obliques in place, basically. That's it. There you go. Enjoy.